Well, today's not going to be the best looking day. It's also going to be a little rainy out there. So if you don't have to be outdoors, stay inside. Enjoy it. Enjoy the indoor weather because tomorrow you're going to want to be outside and tomorrow will be perfect for it. I guess it's, I mean, better for sure than what today is going to be. Cloudy and uh, showers mainly to the west, but that doesn't mean that in the bluegrass and even in eastern counties, you're not getting at least a little drizzle right now or maybe just a few sprinkles. But this is where the main line sits. You can see that all the way from basically Cincinnati out towards Washington County. This line has not moved in the last two hours. And basically the reason being is because the center of low pressure sits right about here. So those winds are being funneled down south and that's why this area is just getting hammered with rain. So I wouldn't be surprised if a few flood advisories go into effect over the next few hours because of the fact that that rain once again is basically just sitting there. A few showers out east, but basically from 75 west is where the heaviest of everything sits, and that line will eventually creep further east, but it's going to be a little while before that happens. It's basically waiting for this low pressure to get picked up and sent packing out towards the northeast. Looks like we've got some showers heavy going down towards south southern Bowling Green, but right along the edge, you do see a few little light sprinkles that are coming in, but not to say that there isn't drizzle in most locations. This is a big ripper of a storm. I mean, look at the cold front that's kind of jetting out from the south. A lot of heavy rain that's now moving its way offshore, but you've also got quite a bit of rain up towards the northeast. And they're happy that it is just rain and not snow, like what portions of southern Canada are getting right now. So the low will eventually move out. A little bit of a trough on the southern end will keep clouds in play throughout most of the day today, overnight, and then to tomorrow, it's going to be kind of split as to who gets the sunshine, who gets the cloud coverage. But high pressure will build in for Monday. and That does mean a mostly sunny day. We will be watching this spread of lows as it will move in by the middle of the week and try to up our chances for precipitation. 24 hour rainfall, at least since six o'clock this morning, you can tell there's been a pretty wide variety, a few tenths of an inch. Over an inch in the bluegrass, right along the Ohio River, you've got over an inch and a half. Black Mountain higher in elevations, over two. So quite a bit of rain, but there you go. Model showing that that line sits there for at least a few more hours before that low starts to work itself out. Scattered showers throughout much of the day today. Some heavier rain may come in this evening before it all moves out overnight tonight, early tomorrow morning. Cloud coverage, once again, it's going to be kind of split. I think if you are Interstate 75 and west, you will get some sunshine tomorrow. If you are Interstate 75 and east, kind of a mix or it might be cloudy, but either way, we do stay dry, especially going into the beginning of the upcoming week. So for today, rain showers throughout, getting a little bit more moderate by the afternoon. Temperatures, best we do, mid 40s. Complete turnaround tomorrow with more sunshine and temperatures reaching the upper 60s, which by the way, 67 is the normal high for this time of the year. So we will have a normal spring day for Easter. Couldn't set that up any more perfect. Now, as we get throughout the beginning of the week, temperatures do spike around the upper 70s, could reach 80 degrees in the southern counties getting into Tuesday afternoon. We will cool slightly throughout the end of the week, and that's only because of more cloud coverage and the fact that we do have some rain showers that are just going to kind of sit with us for a few days. Doesn't look great towards the end of the week. For today, though, mid 40s, chilly. Overnight tonight, cold with rain showers coming to an end. And your eight day forecast will show that the beginning of the work week, Earth Day looking absolutely wonderful. Get out and enjoy it. And then the end of the week, a little rainy with some showers coming in. More news after the break.